Good afternoon. Thanks for joining me today. Today we're going to be creating this card. It's a quick and cute card. I got brought in the Lovely You stamp set so that we can have the different greetings. And I'm doing Just Because. Okay. Set this to the side and pull in my card kit. Okay. So we have a basic white card base. You'll notice that I tend to use basic white as my card base a lot. And that is because I prefer having a white card base um, so that I can uh, write on the inside of it easily. Okay. So you're going to need four of these shapes. I use the Taylor tag or Taylor punch. Okay. <laughs> and then for my designer series paper, I use the pansy petals designer series paper. You can use any paper you want. Um, so I'm just going to put adhesive. I'm sorry if you hear my dog bark, it's starting to storm here. He's afraid of storms. Um, so he has to wait while mommy does her live. <laughs> um, he's okay. My husband's in there with him, but he, you will hear him because he is deathly scared of storms. So I just line this up, a, leave it a little border. And then what I'm going to do is come in, leave a little bit of space in between these two, just like that. And then this shape, you will see it fits perfectly. Just leave a little bit of border. And then I did the same thing at the top. Okay, quick, easy. So next I'm going to put adhesive on the back of my fresh free chef piece. Okay, so then I'm bringing in, this is the basic white. So it's called the basic twi Baker's Twine Essential Pack. And you get crumb cake, berry vanilla, basic black, and of course white. <laughs> and I've been using this a lot, so I need to get more. And so I wrap this around, this time I'm wrapping it around three times. Um, I have just enough to do that. So we're not going to mess with the bow or anything. Okay. So we're just going to put that on there. And then I punched one out of basic white and we're going to bring in our fresh freesia ink. I don't know if I'm saying that right or not, but um, we're going to ink up our Just Because and stamp it. You could stamp it first and then punch out. I rocked mine, sorry. That's why there's two sides to every piece of paper, right? Okay, I'm going to bring in our dimensionals. And we're going to add this to the front here. Just like that. Perfect. Isn't that adorable? So, next what we're going to do is I want to bring in one of the... Bear with me for a second. Okay, so I'm going to bring in... This is the new... This is a brand new designer series paper. It's, um, sorry, <laughs> I'm trying to pack this not open. Hold on one second. Okay. So this is a celebration paper that's coming out. Okay. So I'm going to show you all, show you it real quick. This is all. So this is going to be for, available in August, August, starting August 3rd. And every time you spend $50, you'll be able to choose an item. And this paper is one of those items. Okay. So you're going to see lots of projects coming up with this and the penguin bundle. Cause I am in love with my penguin. I love the stamp set and the coordinating punch. So what I decided I'm going to do now is we're going to create a second card. I'm pulling in the fresh freesia again, and then we're going to just use these two pieces of pattern paper. I'm going to punch two of each. Normally I would say you could use both sides, but by using both sides of this one, you're going to get the penguins and stuff and they're not going to be in the right orientation. So here's what we're going to do. 
I'm going to put adhesive on these. And we're going to line them up just like we did. Just like I did on the other card. Okay. And then we'll line this one up next to it. So let's move those, let's put those two to the side. Let's pull in this navy and do two of them. We'll do a navy at the top and the bottom. Sorry. I just needed a third pattern. You don't have to have, I just thought it'd look better if we added a third pattern to this. Just like this. Okay. So we know we're out, I'm out of white twine. So let's bring in, perfect. Let's bring in the fresh freesia ribbon. Okay, scissors. This card was such a fun, easy card to make and fast that I just decided we would, um, Make a second card using the new product from the um, Occasions catalog that's coming, or the July to December mini catalog that is coming out. It'll be available to Custer's um, August 3rd. Let me grab a card base. I take my white, basic white paper and I score it at four and a qu quarter, then I cut it in half and I do a whole pack at a time and I have it sitting to the side of my desk easy peasy um so we're gonna grab another piece of this fresh fresh of ribbon this is just part of the end color ribbon um I'm gonna do a little bow on this one to the side over here and flag this so we're going to have it say just because again. So let's get my ink back out. Okay. Just like that. And then I did a project this week and that I used. Um, I didn't pop this one up. I'm just using an adhesive. But I did, I stamped a whole bunch of, there's a bundle coming out. It's called Penguin Place and it's got a coordinating punch. So I stamped a whole bunch of these penguins and cut them out. This one I just added dimensionals to. We're just going to add him to the front there. And there we go. Perfect. Turned out so cute. And it was quick and easy. You see me just created no problem. So if you have any questions, please let me know and I will come back and answer them. Thank you.